Now is your opportunity to honor Teachers of Excellence. Bill Anderson with MECAD joins us right now. This is the second annual Teachers of Excellence Awards? Yes, it is. Okay. Is it a dinner? Yes, it is a dinner. It's, it's a reception from 6 to 6.30 and then the dinner and award ceremony from 6.30 to 8 at the Westin. Now, I, we, we both know that thousands of teachers in CMS yes. do fantastic jobs every yes. day. You've narrowed this down to 25. Yes. Hard job. How do you do that? It was very challenging. First of all, we ask for principal recommendations. Yeah. And we look at academic achievement. We look at school leadership. We look at how involved they are in their school communities. And I can tell you there were 159 really good candidates. Yeah. Narrowing it down to 25 was very difficult. Um, so what do they, uh, what do they get? Uh, they receive, there are some gifts they receive, they receive a plaque, they receive yeah. recognition, but based upon the folks from last year, yeah. being recognized I would think so. is number one. Yeah, yeah. You, you have some videos on, on, on your website of uh, <laughs> teachers finding out. Correct. It, it, you, it's sort of, you ask the clandestinely, the, the, is it the students who are filming this? No, or? it's actually an assistant principal or another teacher, but it is very clandestine. They didn't know it. <laughs> we have a video that plays, and then they find out in the faculty meeting, and they're, they're really, they're, they're hilarious. They're yeah. great. Which is amazing. I mean, they don't get paid very much, Correct. and they're not really being rewarded to any great degree by this. It's not like they're winning a car or something like that, Correct. and yet they're ecstatic. Absolutely. Um, you know, our message at MECED is that teachers are absolutely critical to the yeah. success of all schools and that we as a community have to invest in our teachers. You nailed it. We don't pay teachers much. They're not always valued in society. And so this is MECED's small way of recognizing some of the yeah. best, but also helping our community understand that it's in everybody's best interest that we recognize our best teachers. This is coming forward May 8th. It's going to be at the Westin uh, Charlotte. Correct. Uh, cocktail reception starts at 6 o'clock, and then uh, dinner and awards after that. Um, tickets, I take it? On our website, uh, we've already sold about 300 tickets, so okay. we hope that uh, we'll sell this thing out. All right. Um, before you go, I want to talk to you. Charlotte Mecklenburg School Board just uh, adopted a whittled down plan. Yes. Um, for uh, its uh, for CMS's um, uh, long-term facilities plan. Yes. Roughly about three hundred million dollars. So I guess two hundred ninety-four million dollars. That yes. will be going to county commission. What is your job in this? And what do you think uh, our job as citizens should be in promoting this? Or or not. MECED's job is to inform, educate, and engage the community. So what we will do is we will inform folks as to what is actually happening. Um, we will probably host some community forums yeah. in the very near future to talk about this. Uh, it has been whittled down, but the realities of the finances, you know, CMS is dependent upon state finances and yeah. also county finances, and there's still some question marks around the reevaluation and some yeah. other issues. So it's to be seen what CMS and CPCC will share when there'll be a bond. Oh, if, there's, if there's a bond. If there's a bond, that's yeah. true. Uh, Bill, it's always great seeing you. Thanks, so one Rob. more time, it's May 8th at the Western Charlotte Teachers of Excellence. 25 great recipients will be receiving a, a little bit of recognition. Yes, Thanks for joining thanks us. Thanks very much. That's our end of conversation for today. We'll be right back.